Hey, that's right. You certainly needed the rain gear today. That is for sure. And you'll need it for a little while tomorrow as well. Right now, we have some very heavy rain that is falling, especially for areas south of Baltimore. Here's a look at live Doppler radar. Some of the heavier amounts you can see there in the yellow and the orange and the red. That's the more moderate to heavy rainfall that is coming down. As far as how much we've seen so far, well, this is the dual pole estimate. So Doppler radar estimates uh, that there's anywhere from one to three inches in portions of southern Maryland, including including places uh, just south of La Plata, even a little speck there on the map just north and east of Bel Air, and then even on the eastern shore around one to three inches there in the yellow. So that's some pretty impressive totals. And as a result, we do have a flood warning for portions of Calvert and St. Mary's counties. This is until 345 a.m. An additional one to three inches of rain will be possible. So as we move throughout the overnight hours, notice the rain really doesn't stop all that much, but by about seven Seven o'clock tomorrow morning, we'll start to see things tapering off from west to east. This front's very slow to move, but it is going to be pushing on out throughout the day, and we will get some improving weather. However, the sun really won't come uh, to, back too much until we head into Friday. So these waves of low pressure have just made for a very, very messy day today. The rain's going to taper off Thursday, and then temperatures will actually fall rather than rise behind the front. As for the tropics, and we're talking tropical. Storm Ada still impacting and pounding the Gulf Coast of Florida. It's going to be traversing the state. The good news is the front that's bringing us rain right now. Well, that's going to help to put Theta out to uh, Ada, excuse me, out to sea. So we're not going to have any problems worrying about that. In fact, it's also going to just weaken to a remnant low eventually behind that front. All right, temperature-wise, right now we're in the 60s, 69 degrees at BWI. Overnight we drop into the low 60s. Tomorrow a high of 60. But guess what? By 3 p.m., it's actually going to be around 50 degrees as temperatures will be falling throughout the day. 55 on Saturday, 66 on Sunday. Rick and Vic, back to you guys. Okay. Chelsea, thank you.